Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got these uh, three triangles, uh, this uh, yellow right triangle, white uh, right triangle, and this uh, green uh, right triangle fully confined uh, in this uh, big uh, right triangle uh, ABC, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the area of this uh, yellow triangle is 480 centimeter square, and this uh, side length uh, AC is uh, 48 centimeter and moreover uh, this angle uh, EAD is uh, congruent to the D and both are uh, being represented by angle uh, X and furthermore uh, this angle is 90 degrees and likewise this angle is 90 degrees as well and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded uh, triangle please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, yellow right triangle uh, ACD and we are interested in calculating this uh, side length uh, CD. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times base uh, times height. And in our case, uh, the area of this triangle has been given to us as 480 and its uh, base uh, is uh, 48 and the height of this uh, triangle is uh, CD. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So 480, the area of the triangle is going to be equal to a half uh, times the base is uh, 48 and the height of the triangle is CD. Let's simplify. We are going to have 480 turns out to be equal to 24 times CD. And we are going to divide both sides by 24. This is gone. So therefore our CD length turns out to be 20 centimeter. So therefore our this uh, CD segment length turns out to be 20. And now let's focus once again on this uh, right triangle uh, ACD. And this time we are going to calculate uh, this uh, hypotenuse uh, length uh, AD. So therefore we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. And in our case, uh, this side is our uh, hypotenuse and our two other legs are 48 uh, and 20. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, 20 square plus uh, 48 uh, square equals to a d whole square. Let's simplify, that is going to give us uh, 400 plus uh, 2304 equals to AD square. So therefore uh, AD square is going to be equal to 2704. I'm going to undo this square by taking a square root on both uh, sides. So therefore our uh, AD length uh, turns out to be 52 centimeter. So therefore our this uh, side AD length uh, turns out to be 52. And now let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ABD. And we can see that this is an isosceles uh, triangle since uh, this angle uh, is uh, X uh, and this angle is X uh, as well. So therefore we conclude uh, that this uh, side length uh, BD is going to be equal to this side length uh, AD. So therefore we conclude that this uh, white uh, right triangle AED is going to be congruent to this uh, green uh, right triangle uh, BED according to angle side angle congruency theorem. And since uh, these uh, triangles are congruent, therefore uh, their area is going to be equal as well. Let me label the area of this uh, green triangle as uh, uppercase A. Then the area of this uh, white triangle is going to be uppercase A as well. So therefore uh, the total area for this uh, triangle uh, ABC is going to be A plus uh, A plus 480. So therefore uh, this uh, ABC triangle area is going to be 
2a plus 480. And I'm going to label this one as our equation number one. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this big right triangle ABC. We know that this side length AD equal to this side length BD. If this side length is 52, then this side length has got to be 52 as well. So therefore, this whole length BC is going to be some of these two individual lengths 20 plus 52 that is going to give us uh, 72 and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times uh, base uh, times height so therefore for this uh, triangle uh, abc its uh, base is uh, 48 and the height uh, is uh, 72 so therefore our triangle ABC area is going to be a half times 48 times 72 and if we simplify the right hand side this is going to be equal to 1728 so that's the area of this triangle ABC it turns out to be 1728 and I'm going to label this uh, as our equation uh, number two. And here we are ended up with these uh, two equations, one uh, and two. And now we are going to compare these two equations. We can see the left hand sides uh, are uh, identical. So therefore we are going to equate the right hand sides as well. So therefore we can write uh, two times uh, a plus uh, 480 equal to 1728 and now we are going to subtract 480 from both sides this is gone so therefore 2 times a turns out to be 1248 let's divide both sides by 2 to isolate a so therefore the area a turns out to be 624 and since this uh, A represents the area of this uh, green triangle, so therefore this uh, green triangle area turns out to be 624. So thus after all the calculations, the area of this uh, green shaded triangle BED turns out to be 624 centimeter square. So therefore the area of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, turns out to be 624 centimeter square. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.